Could you, could you tell us a bit about the partners you have uh, on, uh, on this product? Yes, absolutely. It's a very good point because, as you know, IBM does not manufacture chillers. We don't manufacture UPS systems. But what we do is we have relationships with the global, uh, the leading suppliers of those pieces of equipment. Uh, so you see many examples around here from, from APC units to Eaton, Stoltz, and many others, Vet Corporation, and so on. So what we do is we find the best suppliers of equipment around the world and we bring them together into a totally integrated solution. So what we do is we use our design expertise along with all of our partners' equipment, the knowledge we have of designing and building data centers and our IT equipment, and we bring it all together into a total solution package. So what the client is getting is the best of everything that's being offered. So as you can see from the chillers to the UPS systems, uh, we've got different types of cooling solutions as you'll see overhead fan coil units we could use. We have in-row cooling units, uh, like this one on the end. We also have the IBM rear door heat exchanger. It's a door that fits on the back of the rack. You can see it only adds about three or four inches in depth, but it removes all of the heat that's generated by this rack. It's basically a chilled water uh, loop, or like a radiator system. There's no moving parts, requires no electricity, no service, no maintenance, and there's no noise, there's no fans. So basically it's the, the server fans which push the hot air back, go through this uh, coil which is very low resistance and it removes all the heat. So actually when this door is closed and it's operating, when you feel the temperature on the back of the door, the air coming out is actually cooler than the air going in the front. So it's very energy efficient, very effective. And we can put these on every rack within the container and that would be the total cooling solution. We can supplement it with either overhead fan coil units or the in-row cooling unit, so we have different options, but very efficient, very effective solution. This is the uh, fire detection and suppression system. So we have a VESDA system where we're taking air samples constantly, and what we're doing is, is checking to see if there's any particulate in the air that might signal that there's a fire. If this senses a fire, we release a gas. In this case, we have Novak gas because it's safe for humans. We could use any other type of gas, Energen or FM200. And on the end here, you'll see the, uh, basically the, the power, the, the main power panel. So your incoming power, you have your main circuit breakers and your branch circuit breakers, as well as transient voltage surge suppression to filter the, the incoming power before it even goes to the UPS. So again, as you can see, we've got all the features of a traditional data center built within a container. So there's nothing left out. So everything you expect to find in a complete turnkey data center is within the container.